Greetings all, Frog here. Let's play Europa Universalis 4 with our Lothian Great Britain campaign. What are you doing sitting around? Oh, you're the dude that I picked up that I didn't really want. Okay, makes sense. Oh, mouse, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Everything was fine. Okay, I don't know, there's some weird system stuff going on. Uh, what are we doing? We just finished the war. How is our coalition looking? Not too shabby, honestly. Norway is the only one that's really pissed. Oopsie. And of course, if you don't remember, because it's been nine days since I played, but you probably remember because it's been two days, we're, we left this one so we could still get to uh, Africa. So we can get down there and take uh, them, and then it'll get us into Mali, which is probably our next biggest challenge, considering that Byzantium and Poland are still our friends. Yeah, I don't think there's going to be a coalition forming out of this, so that's good. All right, we're never going to be the Defender of the Faith. We have claims where... All right, we're coring all those things. We should probably wait until the coring is done and then attack. How long is this claim good for? I don't know. You would think it would tell me when I hover over it. That's unfortunate. Okay. Um, we may do that. Truces. Yeah, yeah. Denmark doesn't exist, so <laughs> no truce with them. That's not a lot of provincial unrest. Honestly, most of that will go away when the overextension goes away, which we barely have worked on. Let's talk about idea groups then. Um, we have time for a new idea group. We are balanced, actually, so we can pick pretty much whatever we want. Uh, late game, what are good idea groups? I don't know. I don't normally play late game. We only have 90 years left. Let's let time travel. Okay, that's fine. As we talk about this, what do we want? late game. I mean, colonists maybe to colonize, but I mean, it's sort of a little late. Don't you think? More merchants would be kind of nice, not gonna lie. Bohemia was building a spy network. It's fine. It's fine. All that blockaded ports comes in and out. Oh, we gotta do something with our diplomats while we're sitting here. Let's make sure Poland still likes us. Let's make sure the Byzantines still like us. We'll just top those out. Um, we are already doing that, so that won't help. Um, the only thing we can claim against Norway is that. So let's look to... Poitou? They don't like us. We could look towards Poitou and get some stuff for Leon. Has Leon been claiming? I love how it does that. Okay, Leon. You're not claiming anything? Marches claim stuff, don't they? Colonies. How about the colonies? You claiming anything over here? Come on, man. Get working. Uh, no, they're not claiming anything. Come on, Leon. I gotta get to claiming stuff. All right. Well, fine. We'll go after Porto. Uh, so our diplomats are moving. Um, right. Late game, late game, late game. Naval? Mm, not really. Quantity? Just get, just overwhelm people with manpower. Offensive is tempting. Oh, you've got to be. Never mind. Come home. Cannot believe it wore out right then. Hilarious. Military access, sure, come on in. Hungary and Dittmartian. Sounds good. Do I still have a claim on Dittmartian? I do. Should wipe them off the map. They're at war with the Congo. As you do. I wonder who would actually come in on that. Probably a lot of people. <laughs> Espionage for the hilarity? Cavalry combat ability is not bad. Ooh, national unrest. That's good. Yeah, I don't think that really matters. It's a little late for diplomatic. Um, Naval might be the winner. Naval might be the winner, just for the force limits. I mean, that's going to be huge. 
can do that with Quartzo when they come back. What are we making a lot of points of? Right now, it's... Well, it's this. Military is going to be it. Let's let's go military. If that's the case. It's either going to be offensive or quantitative. I mean, none of this really matters. This one's good though. We get an extra pip in shock and fire eventually. That's nothing to sneeze at. That's good too. I mean, that's not awful. It's not great though. I kind of like this. We could do ship durability if we wanted to, or we could do trade efficiency and trade power, which is where we get all of our money. We don't need galley combat, though, that's sort of the thing. Heavy ship is better. Ship durability. Defensive just seems like it's too late. It's offensive or naval. It's too offensive. We'll go through the offensive idea group. Although, uh, using military and falling behind in military doesn't make sense, but we are 13 years ahead of time. We're never going to have an institutional tech penalty again. We're losing money. Oh, because all our forts are being maintained. Good God. Stop that. Oh, the mercenaries here. Do we still need the mercenaries? Wasn't I building new units? 42, 42, 42. And I have mercenaries and I'm still okay? Holy crap, yes I am. Alright, let's dismiss the mercenaries. Um, and build... a new 42-er. Where's my mouse? Mouse, where are you? There you are. Um, build a new 42-er on, uh, on our homeland. We had the money, we had the manpower. Why not? So now I've got four regiments of 42, which is good. And I still have eight more to play with. Just two more cannons in every group. Cores are being created. I need more seats in Parliament. Okay. Um, who do we want to get a seat in Parliament? have one. Give Calais a seat. I mean, it's, it's the estuary. Oh, it's not the estuary. Whoa! We can remove stuff from the Empire. Because I can never be in the Empire, correct? Yeah, because the state religion is Catholic. Incessant strife, both religious and political, within the whole HRE is draining the morale of Picardy's population. The relation with the Emperor has reached an all-time low, and King William's dishonorable reputation hasn't improved our situation. Many consider it to be impossible. Are you really sure? Yeah. We're out. None of our land is going to be in the Empire. Sorry, buddy. Piss off the Empire. I don't care. We can take him. The Empire is nothing now. We will have no Imperial land. Is there Imperial land over here? Come on, mouse. Yep. You're out, too. Poland, you should you should remove land from the Empire as well. 
No more Empire. HRE is meaningless. It is a puppet state. Oh, right. Um, so you're not the estuary. I've already put the estuary in. Oh, oh I didn't have the estuary. Never mind. Are you in the... Uh, you don't have a seat in Parliament. You should have a seat in Parliament. Holland, I assume, does. Yeah. Okay. We're going to have to give a few more seats here eventually. Can the theory? No. Too cheap. Too cheap. Don't have that kind of money. Or, I don't have that care. Or something. Whatever it is. You're not getting it. That's all I know. Uh, lose 10 prestige. Or have foreign spy detection minus 25%. Whatever. He's a relative. Right? Can't piss him off. We can actually form a state over here. These are two different states. Newfoundland. Newfoundland. Newfie. No, Newfie is a territory. All right, make it a state. It's fine. Court all. It's almost territorial Canada. So close. Wish I could add it to the 13 colonies. I wonder if I can. Because I'd love to not have a second colony. Know what I mean? He's not good, but he's at least a leader. This way increases his chances to die. The states demand control of pounds. So, oh, didn't even pay attention to that. Clears you want more. All right, not a problem. I can remember what I'm doing here. Clears you want more. Here, I have 0.7. There's no imperial authority whatsoever. Very rude. Sweden, just so you know, um, your land is mine. Until 58, which we're going to crush you eventually soon anyway. I mean, I've got 42 ships, which I haven't even mothballed my ships, come to think of it. Are my navies actually moving? Nope. What are you? You're the transport fleet. All right, the fleets that should be moving are moving. You should probably stop pirateering or something. There's a ton of pirates. I'm spending money on you. I will do something. Um, yeah, in the English Channel, how can I only have that much? Come on. Where are those pirateers? Uh, where are you? You're at sea. I'm going to land at Norfolk so I can go bind you guys. Do we attack Sweden now? I mean, no, we're still going. We're still going. Let's finish all the forces. But... Parliament, not a problem. Um, I don't have you. I assume Hamburg is the seat. They don't. Well, now you do. I like your undead to some more states. You want a state? You got a state. Yeah. I don't think the states are always worth it, but they feel like they are. We've been using a three. Do we need a three? I don't think so right now. I think what we do is we get our hmm, stability costs? Yearly prestige. I think we get prestige. 558 is fine for now. It'll be a 6510 uh, on the other side. I'm assuming we're still monstrously ahead. We are, so we'll get the offensive ideas. Which one was that? Recruitment time? Yeah, well, that was. Should have waited for that. It's okay, it's okay. Um, is this the best general? 023, 120, 131. 023. Is going to be the best one for a naval landing. So if you could just move your, if you could just move over here, yeah, that'd be good. Um, if you guys could just move over here, no reason, just you know, just stay right there. It'll be fine. Everything's good. There's no cause for alarm. Hee <laughs> hee. Need more money. 
Um, first off, can we buy a check? Yes, we can buy more boats. Give me a template. There you go. That's a template. Cool. First European how to make porcelain. It's about 24 years late. That's fine. Uh, template name. Uh, we can call this... Uh, uh, a score of lights. Okay. Uh, give me one of these. 354 days. Whatever. Just give me one. Give me two. There's even 40 more ships that I can throw into service. So, another seat in Parliament. Okay, well, I'm on the trade note as it is. London obviously has a seat, right? Yeah. Lothian? It's controlled by the clergy, so I can't give it a seat. Bummer. That'd be a great place to give them a seat. I don't know why that here is really the place to do it. Back in the New World? That seems strange. Isn't it? Yeah, none of them are very important, so forget that. Um. Um. Kent has a seat. Hampshire has a seat. Somerset has a seat. Cornwall is owned by the church. No, I don't think that's a better place. Norfolk? Probably. Oh, S oh Essex has one. Okay. Lancashire. Yeah, I think Norfolk. There you go. Our military advisor has died. Discipline or morale? We can afford the morale, dude. We will. I can't afford the world, right? But yeah, yeah. Easy. Easy peasy. Uh, we have tons of tr trade power there. Um, we will probably beef up Lubeck with 20 of them. And then we will add more to the Baltic. I think that's the way it's going to work. If I were to say, I don't know, walk on over and declare war, everybody would join me. Ferrara and Dish Dittmartian would join, but I don't care. Oh, I do care about Dittmarsh, actually. We're at one, two, zero. We've got a two, four, two. It's very rude. Is there a river? So, no. It's only 5,000 men. Come on. What are you afraid of? Get my men to Hamburg. So we'll get them into Hamburg. Um, do we do another uh, another transport fleet so we can move two armies around? God, it seems like such a waste of boats. Oh, we make almost 50 ducats a month. I've got a level 3 advisor. That's sick. I like it. I'm going to come back over here. So we'll get Dittmarsh at the same time. That'd be nice. A little twofer right there. Uh, I don't care about Ferrara. Do we need Poland for this? How many favors do we have with Poland? 39, I mean, might as well, right? Just drop Poland in. We I mean, don't need them. Ferrara's not a risk, are they? No. Boats aren't that big either, right? No. I'm pretty sure we have the largest... Navy possibility in the world. Pretty sure we also have the largest navy. We do. We're actually significantly higher than the um, Byzantines. We have another 40 boats on order, and we can still get another 21. So that's nice. Um, in terms of for army force limit, the Inca and Mali are still higher. Also, Selix and Poland. Good lord. You guys are disgusting. Now, in terms of actual force, we have the most in the world. But in terms of capable force, look at that. God. Manpower is disgusting. Well, look, it's a little early, but I'll talk my way to the end of 20 minutes. And next time, we're going to declare war on Sweden. Take Sweden and Dittmarsh at the same time. Which will be nice. And then, psh, Bob's your uncle, really. We'll just keep playing. Another 87 years to go.
So that's that's what we've got going for us. For now, we are out of time. Hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, click the like button. Subscribe to the channel to stay updated. Everything is happens. Until next time, cheers.